we do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it. Hey, chip. Guess they forgot I really spit. Guess so. Doing songs, hooks and verses, hooks and verses. Let's go. Show up. I need inspiration. Used to get my dick sucked in the essence faking. Right. Till they fuck a bitch quick with no explanation. Right. I'm just trying to have fun before my aspiration. Took bitches out to eat, that don't mean we dating. That's a fat working. I just did it for the pussy like a cat person. No lie, am I? Caught the eye of my When you put your jeans up, shake side to side. My guys are ride like Maserati. No phony man. This exclusive content like OnlyFans. Not corny nigga. This a young respectful horny nigga. Descendant a jigger. Triple six ya. Say lunatic ya. Ludacrissa. Dissect that to Project Petta. DMXa. Have you ever heard of C Murder? Lil Jamara. Corey Hawkum. TK Kirkland. Gave birth and they earthed him. Mama first man. Manifesting. Years in making. Not in seconds. A lot of ancestors. Nature forces. DNA recordings. Paved way for a mighty morphin. I was poppin' morphin', chop child on his own like a orphan. Then I put the shit together like Will of Fortune. Or am I just fortunate? More success, oral sex, private jets. I'll invest, I'll is next. My style, woo ha! Rich, broke lifestyle, Duval, school y'all. Just bought a new car, won't walk again. Chills and mob dukes talk again. I meditate, go all within. All I do is win, like DJ Khaled, them. Make that poppy, diamonds. They set rocky, smile shiny. So I often smile and grit a mile of men. Can't slow down my group clown. Get the pussy wet head first shower in. I put I was in. Rap beat the power in. Lyrics age like fire wide, never getting old. Call these gold balls. Or even balls of gold. Hey, chip. Shout out to Tony and the Tony Toss Podcast. Once again, another week we still here. This is Real Spill with Real Chills. What I want to spill on you today is I want to talk about scheduling people. Scheduling, scheduling, scheduling. You know, scheduling. If you don't understand me because of my accent, scheduling. S C H. E D U L E. That's schedule. But you get what I mean. Um, <laughs> I was actually thinking about this during the week because, you know, I usually have my routines of how I'm going to do things as far as me, like, you know, say I, well, not say this is what I actually do. Get up, meditate, you know, work out do this that I had it set but then I had different obligations so you know I would lose time where I used to have time and it was just messing everything up and you know when I don't have structure you know I start going a little crazy you know what I'm saying so I you know me being me and having a problem solving mindset I don't think problem, problem. I think problem, solution. So I came up with, okay, I need to start actually making a time to do this. Fitting it in. Said, I'm going to do this at this time. This at this time. I'm going to do this at 1 o'clock. Then 1.30, I'm going to do this. You know, it's important to actually write stuff down and schedule it. Having a schedule... It guides you in determining what your priorities are so that you can spend the right time on the right task. It also reminds you of any forthcoming deadlines. Knowing this, you can block out sufficient time to meet them. So I found an article, right? You know, I've been doing these articles the last few weeks. I'm going to get back into giving you my spell, but. You know, like I said, it's about giving you good information to help you in everyday life navigate through this life, man. I found uh, 25 benefits 
of creating a schedule for your task. You know, this article is by Abby Miller, A-B-B-Y-M-I-L-L-E-R. And it reads, even if this is not number one, this is basically the introductory. Even if you believe that you have a tedious and repetitive job, there are still a variety of tasks that deserve your attention throughout the day, which is very true. But how can you possibly devote the right amount of attention to every one of these jobs? Huh? Huh? You move forward by creating a schedule for your most important task. So let's get into it here. 25 benefits of creating a schedule for your task. Not only will that guarantee you'll get everything done that you want to do, but it will also boost your productivity and you'll also experience the following 25 perks as well. Number one, establishes a routine. These are the benefits, y'all. When you create and stick to a schedule, you're establishing a routine. As a result, you have more structure and discipline in your life. That may not seem necessary, but when you change your anchored With the correct routine, you can fight back against your uncertainty, which can lead to stress and unhealthy habits. This is true. Besides being beneficial to your mental and physical health routine. No, besides being beneficial to your mental and physical health, routines can help reduce fatigue. Mainly, this is... Because you'll spend less time and energy having to make decisions, you'll actually know exactly what to do and when to do it. Two, it relaxes you and others. Even though she just mentioned stress, it deserves to be expounded upon. Expanded upon. Why? Because stress is often considered the silent killer. Y'all hear that? Silent killer. Because of the harm it can put on your mind and body. While a schedule won't wholly phase out stress, it can help. Having a schedule guides you in determining what your priorities are. So that you can spend the right time on the right task. It also reminds you of any forthcoming deadlines. Which I said. Stress is contagious. When you're frustrated, those feelings can spread to others like your colleagues or your family members. If not addressed, that can cultivate a toxic work environment or put a strain on your relationships. So number three, it preserves your most valuable resource. Time. It's without a doubt your most valuable resource. After all, once it's gone, it can never come back. When you have a consistent schedule, you won't be able to add more hours to your day magically. You will, however, spend less time making decisions, planning, and preparing. It also encourages you to stop wasting time on unproductive activities like getting sucked into social media. In turn, because you're more efficient with your time, you'll have ample time to tackle your task, and you'll even have a little extra time to spare on things that you enjoy doing. Four, create benchmarks. Over time, having a daily schedule will give you a baseline on how long it can actually take to complete specific tasks. You can use this knowledge to build more effective time blocks. For example, if you've been blocking out an hour of writing a daily blog post 
and it takes you closer to two, then you can just adjust your schedule. More importantly, if you realize that you're spending too much time on less critical tasks, then you may want to start delegating these resources to someone else. Five, goals become more tangible, like playing the guitar. Anyone can set goals. But if you want to achieve either, you need to have a plan and a realistic schedule. It's not like you're going to pick up a guitar for the first time and pull off a solo that would equal Jimi Hendrix, Eric Clampton, Eddie Van Halen, or Slash. Instead, strategies like the RPM method will help you reach goals. In this instance, you would jot down your goals, chunk your time, create and create RPM blocks for specific goals that include a plan for reaching the goal. Number six, let's rework. When you organize when you're organized and prepared in advance, you're calm, relaxed, and collected. As a consequence, you'll be less likely to forget things like additional details or instructions. If you leave these out, you'll have to come back and add them later. Additionally, you'll make few mistakes not only is this embarrassing, but it also can harm your reputation and you'll also have to spend time correcting your error. Seven, feel more accomplished. Is there anything better than feeling accomplished? Personally, I don't think so. When you think that You've had a productive and meaningful day. You feel good about yourself. In turn, this will encourage and motivate you to replicate that feeling. Eight, tasks become on. Adding something to your calendar is like when an athlete signs a contract. They decide to commit to plan for a team for a certain amount of years and a decent amount of money as well. When putting something in your calendar, you've made a similar commitment. You've blocked out a time to focus on a specific task during that time frame. That's the only team that you're playing. If you're managing a team, then you can assign tasks to each member. It's a simple way to prevent confusion when collaborating on a project since everyone knows what they're responsible for. Nine, develops your reputation. We all have that person in our lives. They're always running late, flaking at the last minute, or missing important deadlines. There could be several reasons why they're like this. But at the top, it's because they are unorganized and have spread themselves too thin. Regardless of the exact reason, you don't want to have this reputation precede you. It's not just not good. It's just not good, man. It's not good for you personally or professionally. Instead, you want to be known as someone who is always dependable and reliable. 10. Prepares you for the unexpected. No matter how organized you are, the unexpected is still ready to pronounce on you. Thankfully, when you have a plan, you'll be in a better position to address this. That's because you already identify you already identify any possible problems in advance. More importantly, you've also left some blank space in your calendar to put out fires without any interference with what you've already scheduled. Number 10, minimizes distractions. Whether you're at home, the office, or a co-working space, distractions are all around. Some of these might be inevitable, but you can minimize them 
when you know that you need to devote 100% of your attention and energy to a particular task at a particular time. For instance, if you blocked out 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. for deep work, then you would close your office door. You could also put your phone on the do not disturb mode, which I do a lot. And you could single task on the work at hand instead of multitasking. 12, less Russian. If you don't understand that, I said less Russian. Russian isn't just stressful. It also impacts the quality of your work and your quest to get as much done as fast as you possibly can. You speed through your obligations and in the end, you're sacrificing quality for quantity. Scheduling could put a stop to this. That's because you're only scheduling the tasks that can realistically do that you can realistically do in a precise amount of time. Everything else gets placed on the back burner until you have the availability. 13, improves proficiency. Doing the same thing regularly can get annoying at some point. However, until then, it can make you more proficient. Going back to the guitar example, if you schedule 30 minutes per day to practice, you will be on your way to becoming a reliable player since you're performing this task over and over again. I just wanted to put a little twist on that, but it says over and over again. <laughs> 14. Keeps the big picture in sight. Having a plan paints a clearer picture of what you need to do. It also encourages you to prioritize the task that will help you achieve your goals. In other words, it reminds you that what you're currently focused on plays a big role in the picture. We're going to do one more. Then I'm going to finish the rest off through the week. Or maybe next week on next week's episode. Because this is, this is good. I don't want to make it too long. No. Last one. On this episode is 15, but I have 25. 15, builds momentum. Have you been putting off a challenge or difficult task? Well, schedule, well, a schedule can help you build momentum to get the ball rolling. Commit to starting a task and working on it for at least 20 to 30 minutes. Stay focused during this time and ignore all distractions. When time is up, you'll likely have more focus on the project and will be willing to continue working on it. Even if you aren't, you made you have made progress during a 20 or 30 minute streak. Once you get started, it's not too hard to keep going and finish up. You'll probably transition to a state of intense focus and even if it's not for long you'll get closer to finishing the big project nonetheless and that was 15 right there 15 benefits of creating a schedule for your task and i got some more for you but we're not gonna make this too long i know some of y'all out there got short attention spans and not patient enough to even listen to this far <laughs> but part two is coming y'all y'all know you know you know stay tuned i'm out a chip me and you will never get along get the fuck up my face you need to move on all right hey 
Well, baby, I'm okay. I can tell we wouldn't mesh by the words that you say. Monterey right. bank account holder, non business disclosure. Frequent rodeo, but it's not my first rodeo. I roll mostly roller coasters. Wild rides with ups and downs, I can't do it over. Save myself. Wise man, life explains itself. Left the nest ahead to raise myself. Got a mission and cause, don't do the same thing. Expect a different result. Can't listen to y'all. Weapons wiser, red flag recognizer, kept it solid. No human tape recorder kept it silent. Blessed with knowledge from the extra mileage. Game spit a third eye healer, make you recognize it. Control my health more, know myself more. I still indulge in Andy's as such. Also ask a wander, so don't get your panties in a bunch. Life's a challenge, my advice is balanced. Like a challenge, results may be quite astounding. My sound nostalgic. Show you how to wear it well, I'm a stylist. I know life and know what I know. Bad vibes, sister, I gotta go. Get from round it, hits from round shit. I deserve royalties. So with my royalties, I should get a pile of chips and salad. Went to the volcanic mountain. At a distance, different surrounding, cause chill need different around them. More cheers and toast, and less moments of silence. Speak the truth, and that's the moment you silence. Constant chaser of money, can't take nothing from me. My Audemars is money, no AP. Life like AP, shit can get ugly. Call it y'all some dummies, life can be a trip. It's like falling off of something. Shut you down early, call them all on Sunday. I do an awesome job, not calling y'all for nothing. Self reliant, how I function. Depending on my independence, slightly reptilian Blending in the villain, Sicilian bitch Inhabitant, inherit new traditions Preparing food in kitchens Every day I eat good for my brilliant decisions Every night I sleep good cause I complete missions All my women tell me I got too many bitches Malik, you look suspicious You crave for my attention So now you're about to get it I tried to be dismissive But you was too relentless To me the shit ridiculous Ain't no pussy where my dick is Nigga, I'm a nigga Worry about the bitches Or worry about Corona Go suck a thumb in Kona Ain't no tricking me Even if a nigga didn't speak I reek with sifting me through energy I squinch by the pinch to see Facial display of disbelief I reek with sifting me through energy I squint by the pinch to see Facial display of disbelief Me and you will never get along Get the fuck up out my face You need to move